I'm Julie from Wonderful Healthy Habits and I want to personally thank you for joining the giveaway. I hope you win. That would be so great. Um, I also, you know, some people don't know what essential oils are. I get that question a lot. And it's really kind of simple. You know, have you ever smelled a rose or torn open an orange and smelled that scent? Well, right then, you're experiencing the aromatic qualities of essential oils. They're, you know, these naturally occurring volatile aromatic compounds. They're found in seeds and bark. Um, they're going to be found in stems and roots and flowers, kind of like the, um, the rose, you know, in the petals of the rose, you're going to smell that. So, you know, they, they, the oils are going to give them that beautiful fragrance, whether it be the rose or the orange or a lemon or lime. They also go ahead and protect the plant, those essential oils. They actually, um, you know, and that's what they can do for us is they can go ahead and protect us also. So essential oils have been used for thousands of years, as we know. You know, they've been used in food preparation, in um, health and beauty products. You know, they're actually, there's a wide range of emotional and physical wellness applications that you can use essential oils with. Now, I use them three different ways. You can use them aromatically, internally, and topically. So aromatically, you might take an essential oil and put, like this is rosemary, so I'm going to just put a drop in my hand. And I also like to mix my rosemary with my lemon. And what that does is that actually helps with concentration, which I could use. <laughs> I don't know if you could use some help with your concentration, but I certainly can. So I just put it in my hands, give it a smell, and it's just, um, it goes right in and gets working immediately, helping me with my concentration with those two oils on there. It's just awesome. You can also put them in a diffuser and diffuse them so the whole room can get the healing properties of the essential oil. Now another way that you can use the essential oils is you can use them internally. So you might take, I like to take my lemon oil and just put a drop of lemon in my water. That's going to go ahead and help detoxify yourself. Also, I'll take, like I take my frankincense. My husband and I take frankincense every day and just put a drop underneath our tongue. So that's another way to use it internally. My grandkids love to put a drop of peppermint oil in their hot chocolate. They just think that's the best when they come to grandma's and they get to do that. So there's several different ways that you can use them internally. Um, you can also, you know, the third way is topically. If you go to get a massage or maybe you have, your knee has some inflammation, you can just go ahead and take a drop of that oil and rub it on the knee. You know, you might, you might use like blue tansy or wintergreen, very good for inflammation. So that's just another great way to go ahead and use those oils. So hopefully that kind of explains a little bit about what essential oils are and how you can use them. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to message me and I am more than happy to answer any of your questions. And once again, good luck on that giveaway. I hope you win. Bye.